And now we're going to head over to the uh, Town Square Park and find out what's going on on the main stage. Laura's Middle House. Well, we can't get out the clothes until 11. It isn't as big a deal as it was a few years back, but still there are lots of people who want to be Little Miss Laura. Because you like Laura. Well, that is a great reason to be here. Where'd you get your dress? Amazon. Amazon? Okay. Do you want to go ahead and do a spin for me? One more and I'll get your skirt. There we go. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thanks. The town square is also full of food. They've got pies and cheese curds and popcorn and donuts and maple syrup and looks like they even have ribs, shrimp and chicken this year. Coming to Laura Days does require some cash so I think it's a great idea to have a portable cash machine here. You really should get down to the museum, but if you don't, the museum comes to you as one of the vendors in the vending area. Well, there's a, a conductor that goes down the aisle with one of these punch things, and he punches everybody's ticket. And so, I'm going to punch a ticket for you guys, so you'll have your very own ticket to the Pepin Depot. Classic rail car. This office car oh. that, um, that was used by the Kennedys and Eisenhower and, and all of those folks. And so, um, yeah, it's, he's very interesting. And there's a caboose up there. There's an ice cream shop in this yeah. area. Yeah. And it's, it's called Flat Penny's Ice Cream. And uh, he went on there. Is the telegraph key like Rose would have used when she was working as the operator? Here's an example of some adults dressed up. I'm telling you, if you are an adult and want to wear your door, Laura dress, Laura Days is the event to come to. Honors Robin, Drea, and Allie Gilbertson, uh, currently living in uh, Plover, Wisconsin, but we've lived all over the place. And this is a, a wonderful festival um, that our daughter Drea um, wanted to go to because she has read all of the books. And uh, we're just having an amazing time here in Pembroke, Wisconsin. Well, that's great. Thank you. There are a variety of different crafts, some period and having to do with Laura, some not. It's a great place to spend part of your day. And hello, Mary. What can you tell us about the vending area today? Well, we have a number of new vendors um, from faraway places. In fact, this one right here is from Montana. And he, they are traveling, and so they stopped in to share Laura Days with us. Um, and we're hoping the weather stays, yeah. and so are all the vendors. Yeah, I think everybody is. But a 30% chance it is is a 70% well, not. not. Exactly. So yeah. we'll have to well, see. Enjoy the day.
Hello, welcome to Laura Days. We are here with pure maple syrup and granulated sugar and maple cream and candies and also photography. I have Laura quotes with taken in authentic places like on the banks of Plum Creek and in DeSmit. And hopefully you come and stop by sometime. Thanks. Well, you are in costume as heroes because I just think it is so great that they have the ambulance service here. I uh, have, in a previous life, I dealt with big events and it is so great to have medical help right here if you need it. Especially, it's kind of hard to get into Pepin during Laura days, so I'm very glad you guys are here. So thank you. I want to say thank you for your service, but that's more military. <laughs> thank you for being here. <laughs> We're getting ready for the Little Miss Laura contest. This song, like super old, like even older than Pa's time. What we're going to do is call the Play Party Dance. You'll see some more of that this afternoon with Robin Dan and Robin Nelson. Um, so stick around, come back if you'd like more dancing. There's a craft area and activities at the top of the hill. Pepin has a great set of photo boards every year. There's the playground. Drop the clothespin. Lasso a horse. They have a train for kids, and there is a charge to ride. I have stumbled on this this year. Thank you for all your help. There's a petting zoo and you can feed the animals. You can take a school bus out to the cabin. There is a medallion hunt buying the clues at the information booth. And I'm happy to say, at least for now, here comes the sun. And things are picking up over here. So, what will you make with me? I don't know yet. I have several skeins of it already. So now they're still the same thickness that way, but it's wider at the top. If you enjoy the traditional craft demonstration, there is a donation box to help keep this area going. Remember, right in the corner where you are. I hope you're enjoying coming along on this trip with me and that you'll remember to check out all the other videos from this trip or any of the others. Check back on this video channel to find videos not only for the trip, but for all sorts of different things, including In the Kitchen with Laura and Trundle Bed Trails. Then look for us all around the web under Trundle Bed Tales on our blog on WordPress, 
on our podcast on Blog Talk Radio, on Facebook, on Twitter, and on Instagram. And no matter where you find us, remember to click the bell, um, honk the horn, and subscribe. <laughs>